welcome to my video on how to varnish flying bases. If you're anything like me, you'd like to um, basically put base onto the bases. I know some people like them clear, um, and that's fine. Personally, though, I like to have them uh, all based up. Two reasons. One, I think it looks better. And two, uh, I tend to distinguish my different units with different bases. So I might have some with rocks on, maybe some without so I can work out which unit is which. I'm pretty fussy, I mean, I even paint up and varnish the, the bottom of the base as well. Uh, so I thought what I'd do is just show you how I do it. So I have a base which is all dry brushed and painted up. Uh, I obviously need to varnish before you put the static grass on. So um, the, the problem that you have is of course when you spray this is you've got this little plastic rod and if you get varnish on that it tends to go all dull and, and it doesn't look see through anymore it just sort of ruins it really so uh, what I tend to do is I use this now this is the top of a paintbrush quite a thick uh, paintbrush not just a normal one uh, so you may not have that many of these at home uh, but you just pop a bit of blue tack on and that just slits over there and ready to go ready to varnish now obviously because these are the big paint brushes and you might not have that many if you're doing a big squad you don't want to just do one base at a time so you need to make your own ones and that's what I've done here it just goes over and I thought I'd just show you how I make that it's pretty simple it's a bit like going back to school just get yourself a piece of paper and well, this is a whole paintbrush you could use a pen I suppose Basically what you need to do is uh, wrap it around your paintbrush, like so, and put a bit, pop a bit of sellotape on there, like that, and then what I would do is, I'd actually cover this, all of this in sellotape. Uh, and then just cut it to the appropriate size uh, maybe like that, you'd obviously measure it before you cut it and then all you need to do, once, obviously that will all be set of taped up all the way around so it won't come undone and then just put a um, piece of set of tape over the top because obviously you don't want the varnish to go into the hole and there you go, you've got a flying base protector just to pop on, easy, simple inexpensive and uh, does the job quite nicely so hopefully that's useful to someone um, as usual please uh, please rate comment below and uh, thanks for watching mm -hmm.